If I had to lose 60 pounds again, like I did not too long ago, here's exactly what I would do. Number one, I would track my cap, my calorie and protein goal for the day, because what gets measured gets managed. And just like a financial budget, if you don't know how much you're spending, you can easily overconsume calories and stay exactly where you are or worse gain. So we want to lose, so we can do that through our numbers. Number two, I would walk more, try to get 8,000 plus steps in a day. There is some real science behind the benefits of this without taxing your nervous system to the point you burn out, i.e. Orange Theory group fitness classes. Three, drink three liters of water a day. I don't need to go through the laundry list of why this is beneficial, but it does suppress appetite. So that's a key for this. Four, strength train. This is what I overlooked a lot in the early going and it cost me. You want to lose fat, not fat and muscle, by strength training, you minimize the amount of lean tissue you lose. And lastly, I would prioritize sleep and stress management. Try to get seven plus hours in a night and you will feel better for it. It's actually when you breathe out your body fat, believe it or not, very little is excreted through your sweat and urine. And you do that consistently over time. Now, if you have 60 plus pounds to lose, don't try to lose it all in one shot. Think of it in 12 to 16 meat blocks, burn phases. Try to lose up to 20 pounds in that time frame. It'll be less over subsequent phases with a flat maintenance phase for a period of two to four weeks or less, depending on how quickly you reset before you try to lose the next 20 pounds over 12, 16, 20 weeks. Give yourself a year. I promise you, if you look at it in incremental steps like that, you're going to succeed. Assuming you follow those big five habits I shared off the top, it's the same template we use with our clients in Calvert Fitness. We install the big five framework. We keep them accountable. We surround them with the community and tools to help them succeed. So let me know if you want any info on that as well by sending me the code word coaching.